On this screencast, I'm going to go through uh, basically starting with a clean PC and uh, show you how to install what you'd need to communicate with an Arduino board through Python. Uh, we'll start with installing Python. Uh, we're just going to install, well, we recommend using the Anaconda because it comes with a lot of useful packages. I'm going to go to this continuum.io for the download and Windows. So I want to download that package. So right here, uh, we're going to use the 3. Point something version, not the 2. Point something version. Okay. Thanks on the cheat sheet. Downloading down here. Click on it so that it runs as soon as it's done. Next. Okay, this will take a while. Okay, finished. Okay, so it should have installed. Um, There. I'm going to open up uh, Spider. I'll use that. I've just set up a uh, little light sensing circuit. Uh, the details in this aren't really that important. I just wanted something in which I could show that we're indeed reading data. But before that will work, I need the uh, driver for uh, the Arduino board. I also need the uh, script editor for the Arduino board because I need to upload basic or standard formata onto the Arduino board before uh, Python will be able to communicate with it. So to install what I need for um, the Arduino board, so we'll go Arduino. No, it's right there. Software. I like the web editor, but I'm, for now I'm just going to download the uh, IDE for Windows. Windows installer. That is done. I'm going to go ahead and open up Arduino. Power access. Okay, I'm going to plug in my Arduino board. Standard for Mana. Let's see, I think it's in 
examples. And here Fermata, standard Fermata. So I open that up, and I'm just going to upload that to my board. And you can see it's compiling. This is done compiling. You should start to see it communicate with the board. Yeah, there it goes. It's uploading now. So now the board should be ready to listen for commands from Python um, through the USB cord. So I'm going to minimize that, open this up. Um, there's some code that I had written that I'm not going to go through the details of that. We'll talk about it in class and discussions. Uh, it was a comment on the bottom of this video, I guess. But the code basically goes through and takes a voltage reading from every analog in pin. But before that will work, um, we need to have uh, PyFormata installed uh, so that well, so that Python can, can communicate as well with Formata devices. So let's see. I'm gonna. in here. So I'm going to go to Anaconda, Anaconda Prompt, hopefully, okay, and I'm going to pip install PyFormata, so pip install is py That's done. Now I should be able to communicate with my board. So I'm going to go back here. Basically, the script, uh, one of the first things it does is it finds the COM port for the board and then connects to it using the Python auto commands. Okay, I figured out what was wrong. For some reason, on this computer, my uh, I have a function that, that finds the COM port of the Arduino board which you don't need, um, but that function on this computer did, did not seem to work, though it did on my other one. So I'm just going to skip that. I know that it's in COM port 3. I almost put COM 3 there. So now it should find the Arduino board. But before I run this, it's uh, not going to run in Spider because Spider wants to plop things in the, uh, in the console window here. Um, and I want to do a live animated plot. So that's what this code does. So one thing I'm going to have to change is go to Tools, Preferences on Mac. I think it's under Spider Preferences. Um, let's see, and then go to Python Console. Um, or is it IPython Console? IPython Console. Graphics. Uh, graphics Backend. Change that to Automatic. It uh, probably on inline by default. If I change mine, but change yours to automatic. Okay, I think that'll do it. Here it goes. There we go. Okay, so here's my plot. Here's my Arduino board. If I cover up the light sensor, it goes down. So right now only analog in zero is connected. They're all responding just because all the other ones are, are floating, but that just that blue line is the one that's connected. So there, successfully connected Python to an Arduino board with uh, Python. Hope that helps. Control C.